All right, so this one I'm going to do a factory reset of Windows um, operating system using the recovery options. So let's give it a go. We'll go into Windows first. And I'm going to hold the Shift and Power button and restart to go into recovery option pretty quickly. Okay. Now, I'm not going to do that, there's a change of plan. I'm going to reset the password. I can't log in because there's a password. So what I'm going to do is, I'll show you how I'm going to do it in Windows 11. Restart, we're going to boot into our USB, Windows 11, or any Windows 10. You can watch the previous videos on how I boot to um, external USB, disabling secure boot, etc in the same time frame as this video. <coughs> One second. Okay, so what we're going to do, Shift F10. Oh no, troubleshoot, advanced options, command prompt, okay, see if we can access the files, yes we can, so let's go to Windows, CD system 32, and we're going to move, <coughs> so what we want to do is we want to make a copy all right, so we're going to do utilmen to utilmen.old. So we're just going to rename it, if you like. <coughs> yeah. And then we're going to copy cmd to utilmen.exe. Exit. Or we can just do a quick reboot okay and now while it's loading windows we'll get the login prompt again this time we're going to click on the little man there and it's going to open up a command prompt so this is actually in windows Yep. Okay, so what we type there? Okay, so I'm going to go net user, sure, just going to add the local user, Asus. Add. Okay, and we're going to make it part of the admin group. Naked, net, uh, naked, net local group administrator, uh, Asus. Add. Done. So now, if we reboot, shut down, if the, oh, sorry about that HDMI. Okay, it's okay, here we go. Can't even see what I'm typing now, okay. Reboot, okay, so we should see, I'll just hide the username if it comes up. Yep, it should reboot and we should have our new username come up on the list on the bottom left. <coughs> Okay, all right, so I'm just going to hide the window a little bit. Okay, so on the bottom left, you can see Asus now. Let's go, and we're in. Done. So we could do a factory reset, but it will take a long time. But this way we can delete the account create a new admin account and voila we're in business you can use Windows 10 setup or you can use the recovery etc whatever works best so if you use the Windows 10 USB or Windows 11 USB 
just uh, when it comes up with the uh, setup window, Shift F10 to bring the black screen, command prompt, and do the same steps, no different. All right, this is a just a basic Intel Pentium. <coughs> Probably doesn't even have a fan. Doesn't need one. But that's the end of this video. I should be able to just sign back in. Well, that takes forever. Okay. okay, so <clears throat> just for this computer for my purpose. Done. Okay, and this way we preserve any of the Asus apps or crap that is in there. If there is any. Alright, I'll see you in the next one. Thanks for watching.